Looks like our little lady is a bit of a klutz. The next thing you know, she'll be dropping that poor little doggy in the tank. What, that little doggy? <laughs> Hello and welcome to the Nerd Out Shelter, where it's a safe place to nerd out. This is episode 6 of the Ghost Trick Phantom Detective Demo. And in the last episode, well, we made it here to the apartment. And we met a little doggo over here. I'm going to pet him. I'm going to pet the doggo. <laughs> and now we're going to save Miss Camilla over here by leading her to a hiding spot. So what are we going to do? Oh, we got the donuts. We can move the donut. We can rock the donuts. Aha. Okay, let's go ahead and move the cart. I think that's what we're going to do. Oh, okay. We're moving the cart. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, go back in here. And then I think we're going to rock and knock the donut over. Uh, yeah, let's rock the bowl. <laughs> oh, okay. That goes the other way. Okay, interesting. Oh, we can... Oh, well, there's a pink rat now? <laughs> okay, that's crazy. Uh, we can go over to the star. And, oh, we gotta let that thing fly around. All right, let's wait for it. It's all about timing. Okay, there we go. Aha, we made it. And then, can I reach? No, okay. We gotta go back again. And then, uh, okay, back again. <laughs> what is this? Oh, it's a painting. Okay, we can rock the painting. No, I wanna go down here. Aha, perfect. Floor lamp and then the door. All right, let's go ahead and let's open the door. Smack the rat. <laughs> oh, smack the donut. Okay. There we go. Oh, the doggo's under there now. Uh-huh. She see. Oh, missile. No. Oh, it's working. It's working. Oh, no, the rat's... Okay. She's under there. Oh, perfect. <laughs> what are you doing under here, you silly boy? Oh, just saving your life. That's all. <laughs> oh, my little missile. You're always doing the cutest things. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, we're hiding. It's working. Hmm. Nobody's here, eh? Nope, nobody at all. Nothing to see here. Okay, he's <laughs> sitting on us. <laughs> my prey is bound to come home sometime. Might as well make myself comfortable in the meanwhile. Just don't eat our donuts, okay? <laughs> no, I said don't! Oh, you jerk. <laughs> of course. Oh, man. There! Our little lady's fate has been averted! It has? The poor thing is still curled up in a ball and shaking with fear. Yeah, but you're both alive. <laughs> well, yeah, that's true. <laughs> But that's not so bad. In the scheme of things, I'd say she's just fine. And look, you're not dead. Yep. <laughs> oh, you're right. We did it. We did it, didn't we? Well, we're not out of the woods yet. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> well, to be precise, you're the one who did it. Huh? Me? I saved Miss Camilla? Yep. You're the one who led her under the sofa, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you protected your mistress. I can attest to that. Oh. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, fate averted. All right. Can I ask a question? Yeah, shoot. <laughs> sure, what is it? What exactly are those strange powers of yours? Oh, that's the name of the game. <laughs> oh, you mean my ghost tricks? Yeah, see? <laughs> Apparently, they're the power to manipulate inanimate objects. If they're ghost tricks, then I can do them too? I'm dead too, after all. Uh, I guess. That's how it goes, right? I've been staring at those donuts as hard as I could for a long time now. <laughs> but they won't budge for me. Why do you suppose that is? I don't really know. <laughs> I guess you just don't have that power. Well, I have one thing to say to that. That's not fair. <laughs> Sorry, but I guess not everybody who dies gets the powers of the dead. So what's going to happen to me now? Uh, nothing, really. Your death has been erased. You'll just go back to being a happy little doggy, <laughs> living your everyday life. I guess this means goodbye. But we'll meet again sometime, right? Yeah, maybe, if you die again. <laughs> One can only hope. <laughs> what you did for me tonight, I'll never forget it. <laughs> well, I guess we'd better be getting back to the present. Time to see what happens next in our story. Whoa, all right. Going forward in time. <laughs> and now a new present is born. The little lady is still curled up in a ball and shaking with fear. And the little doggy is wagging his tail happily. <laughs> so what am I going to do now? Yeah, we're going to stop this jerk. I think I'll watch for a while and see what happens. All right. Yep. He's looking around. Oh, phone call. Okay. Okay. Don't shoot the phone, dude. <laughs> it's not going to help. <laughs> All right. Who is it? What? Still at the junkyard? All right, got it. I'm on my way. Oh, he's leaving. Oh, that's good. Hmm, I guess my prey likes to play hide and seek. She hasn't had enough of that junkyard yet, apparently. I can't let nearsighted Jigo beat me out on this one. I better hurry. Yeah, get out of here, you jerk. 
Yeah, all right, he's leaving. Awesome. All right, and they're safe. It's okay to come out now. <laughs> You're all good. Just a little dusty. <laughs> what was that all about? You saved me, didn't you, Missile? I just know you did. Yep, he's a good doggo. <laughs> oh, okay, the phone again. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't answer it. Um, okay. Is it the bad dudes again? Okay, she's answering it. Lynn? Oh, trick time. Okay, what are we doing? Um, well, let's go back up. Oh, uh, can we, okay, let's go back around. Um, <laughs> we gotta wait for that thing to come around again. Oh, wait, okay, we got a thought bubble. A call from Lynn, eh? It sounds serious. I wonder what they're saying. I better go possess that telephone and listen in. Yep, okay, get that, oh, that was good timing. All right, now we gotta, okay, let him rotate and stop, okay. What is that? <laughs> okay, I can't reach that. All right, we're going back over here. Um, yeah, we're gonna move the cart. There's that little doggy all curled up on the floor. Yeah, I see him. <laughs> Dreaming away the life we worked so hard to get back for him. <laughs> That's what they do. That's fine, but what's up with that core? Oh, yeah, you're right. The dead can't possess living creatures. That's one of the rules Mr. Deathslamp taught me. <laughs> so what would a living and breathing doggy be doing with a core? I'd better try possessing him and see. All right, let's try it. Oh, we connected. Oh, it's you, it's you. <laughs> it's, hmm, come to think of it, I never did ask your name. I guess it's good we ran into each other again then. This is a good chance for us to reintroduce ourselves to each other. You mean, you forgot my name already? <laughs> no, it's Missile. <laughs> After everything we shared together, the drama, that tearful goodbye, I'm Missile. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. But, you know, it's strange. I wonder why you remember me now that you're alive again. Do you remember your time being dead? Of course, all of it. Okay, let me get this straight. <laughs> the memory of being dead doesn't disappear, and the dead I meet in the ghost world develop a core when they return to the land of the living. All right, I'm following it. <laughs> and if I then possess that core, I can talk to that person? Oh, cool. <laughs> it looks that way, yes. All right, we're back in the cart. Let's go ahead, we're gonna move it. Yep. I'm gonna go back over here. Aha, okay, good, 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 good. I should be within range now with the phone. Yep, there we go, we're in there. Let's listen in. Yeah, there she is, still got her umbrella. Camilla, oh, thank goodness you're okay. Well, I don't know if I'm okay exactly. You won't believe what just ha- Listen to me, you've gotta get out of there right now. But what about dinner? I was thinking about spaghetti tonight. <laughs> I won't be going back there for a while and you might be in danger if you stay there too. Yeah, don't worry, we took care of it. <laughs> But I already was in danger just a little while ago. Meet me at that restaurant, the kitchen chicken. <laughs> Wait, the kitchen chicken? That looks toxic. The chicken kitchen on Dead End Drive. Oh, that sounds delicious. <laughs> Dead End Drive? I don't know, that's pretty far and sounds pretty ominous. <laughs> just hurry, okay? And one more thing, bring the music box with you, okay? The music box, not the headphones, right? Because <laughs> uh, that's a long story about that. Music box? I love music boxes. Is it a present for me? I'm sorry, but it doesn't play. I can't even get the lid open. Then you can't very well call it a music box then, can you? More like just box. <laughs> just bring it, okay? It's kind of big and it's made out of wood. Okay, I will. Where is it? I kind of hid it in that room you're in. Oh, great. Oh, that was in the, I found, I know where it is. Don't worry. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> what the heck? And a pigeon on his head? <laughs> Excuse me. Eek. Lynn. Oh no. Okay, we shorted the phone line. That's not good. <laughs> okay, yep, not again. That yeah, was Missile's fault, don't worry about it. <laughs> Darn, now I've dropped the phone in there too. How about if we tell her you did it, Missile? Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> He's fine with it. But I sure hope Lynn's all right. I better get going. I know right where Dead End Drive is. But I never saw any music box around here. Where am I supposed to find it? Do you know where it is, Missile? <laughs> uh, I do. Help me look, okay? Hey, all right, trick time. Okay, we gotta go back. Oh, let's get out of here. We're gonna get in the cart. Yep, and we're gonna go back over here. Let's go over here, missile. Follow me. Um, We're gonna go, okay, whoa, wait, wait for it. Oh, it's hot bubble. Well, I guess the phone's dead now, too. Wait, we can't bring that one back. <laughs> what are the odds that would happen? <laughs> Looks like our little lady is a bit of a klutz. The next thing you know, she'll be dropping that poor little doggy in the tank. What, that little doggy? <laughs> Anyway, something is happening to Lynn. Yeah, some weirdo with a pigeon. <laughs> I'd better help Camilla find her treasure. Hmm, I don't know if it's because I lost my memory or what, 
but I don't seem to remember what a music box is exactly. <laughs> Alright, oh, okay, we're good. Uh, we timed that pretty good. I want to get up there. Uh, I think that's where it is. So how do we get up there? Oh, rotate faster. Okay, maybe we do that. Alright, let's go rotate faster now. Whoa, okay. Can we? Ah, oh, yes. We're going to swing out. Centrifugal force. Oh, okay, perfect timing. We did it. We did it. Okay, let's turn the latch. That's definitely the music box. Whoa, there it is. Oh, hey, it's on the... Uh-oh. Oh, crap. <laughs> that wooden box that just fell. That just might be the music box we're looking for. Yeah, it definitely is, dude. <laughs> I bet the little lady will know when she sees it. Well, she ran right past it. <laughs> we're really close now. All right. Oh, maybe I can possess it and make it... Oh, okay, wait, we gotta wait for that. Oh, okay, there we go. Man, <laughs> that's some hard timing there. Oh, we can rotate it slower. Okay, let's do that. Slow it down. No, nope. get the box. You just walked past it again. Okay, oh, wait. And go. All right, we gotta get over here. Can we get in the box? No, we can't. Dang it. Oh, we can play the ornament. All right, let's try it. Wait for her to come back. All right, play it. Ah, perfect timing. Did she see it? Yes. Okay, she sees the star. You didn't see the music box? Right there. Yeah, turn around. <laughs> yes, she found it. Awesome. This is it, the music box. <laughs> Yippee. <laughs> All right, whoa, she's got big pockets. <laughs> I'll leave the remote here, but don't touch it, Missile. If the TV comes on, you'll start barking. Yep. I'd hate to find you flattened underneath that wall when I came home. All right, she's off to dead-end drive to the kitchen, kitchen, chicken, chicken kitchen. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving now, Missile. I have to go help Lynn. She's like a sister to me, you know? You'll be good while I'm away, and no barking. <laughs> and then he immediately barks. <laughs> All right, she's out of here. <laughs> oh, he's going back to sleep. Still no peace for the little lady. And the redhead, Lynn, is facing a new crisis right now as well. Meanwhile, I'm in a bit of a pickle of my own. With the receiver at the bottom of the fish tank. <laughs> oh no. I find myself still trapped in this apartment. Too bad I can't just curl up and go to sleep with my tail wagging too. Because there's something I must do. The question is, how do I go about getting out of here? Thank you for playing. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> All right. Well, that does it for the Ghost Trick Phantom Detective demo. If you like this demo, please leave a like. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next demo. And until next time, thank you for visiting the Nerd Ash Shelter, where it's a safe place to nerd out.